Hi guys, this is Megan from the blog WilsonHomestead.com and today I have a bit more of a relaxed video for you guys. I'm just doing a mini haul and this is just a few things that I've gotten for myself this last month. They're not all from the same place, but I have just been absolutely loving all of these things and so I'm just really excited to share them with you guys. I've been kind of on a journey to buying more sustainable and eco-friendly clothing, doing more thrift shopping, and if I do buy things new, I want them to be brands that I really like and trust, and I like their message, and so maybe this will give you some good ideas on where to get a couple of these things. So let's just jump right into this haul. It's actually two things. I got two sweaters at a garage sale that was like right across the street from our house. It was this huge, huge garage sale. It was, I think it was actually a bunch of families who combined all their stuff to one big garage sale. And so I got these two really awesome sweaters for like $5 for both of them. But I absolutely love oversized sweaters and it's so hard for me to find them. Like I'm very, very tall. My arms are really long. So I have to get like extremely big sweaters to get them to be oversized. Like I'm not fat but my frame is just a lot bigger than other women's. These sweaters are actually like 4x size which is like way too big for me but I love the look of oversized sweaters. So this first one is just this creamy colored one. It's just kind of like more of a chunky knit. It's really cozy and it's very big on me but I love it. I like wearing it with some more of skinny jeans. The, the top part is more of like a baggy but what I'm wearing on my bottom half is more tight. I think that looks really good together. I wouldn't wear this with like a, a big flowy skirt, but I think with skinny jeans, it looks really nice. Here's the other sweater. It's open in the front and it has some buttons part way down. Just a smaller section of buttons that doesn't button all the way down the front. But this one's so big and long on me that I like wearing it as a robe too. It's just really comfy. But I was just thrilled to find both of the sweaters because I've been on the lookout for some big oversized sweaters for me. And it's surprisingly hard, so. I was very excited and I've been wearing them like all the time and I'm disappointed that it's so hot out because I really want to wear my sweaters. So I've been suffering through the heat wearing sweaters because it's fun to wear new things. The next thing I got are actually some underwear and I'm ridiculously excited about these underwear. It's a little weird. <laughs> I've never been this excited about buying underwear before but and I actually haven't bought an underwear in like five years. I have all these underwear that are like stretched out and have whole big holes in them and I've just been kind of limping along on all these horrible underwear <laughs> and I've worn them through two pregnancies so now that I'm I've lost some weight from his pregnancy they don't even stay up so my pants will stay up but my underwear will pull down this seems a little weird to be talking about on YouTube but you know I gotta be honest with you guys so I decided it was time for some new underwear and when I get pregnant again, I will buy some underwear specifically for pregnancy because I am not going to stretch out these underwear. I love them too much. But I just looked up and did some research on the most eco-friendly underwear brands, the most affordable and eco-friendly, and I found this really awesome brand called Booty. They have all kinds of things, including underwear and bras, and I think they even have like exercise pants and tank top camisole type shirts. So I was just really impressed with their values and that they use eco-friendly material and their packages are made out of recycled paper. And so I was just really excited to buy some underwear from them because I'm trying to move more into the sustainable direction. So here's one of the pairs. I got two different kinds. One is more of the Brazilian cut. The other ones are more of a classic bikini cut. Both of those are black. And then I got two pink ones. I actually like these the best. I just, they fit so comfortably. I thought I was gonna like the other ones better, but I like these better actually. And I am in love with the material. Like it's very, very soft and stretchy, but yet it feels very sturdy. It's made out of bamboo yarn that has been grown organically, no pesticides or insecticides, which I love. And then the last thing I got are these super cool yoga sling shoes. I have seen so many good things online in minimal circles about these Sanuk women's yoga sling shoes. Let me tell you guys, my flip flops have been getting really old and kind of nasty. So I decided to invest some money in some new shoes and I am loving these so far. They are about $30, which isn't bad for this kind of a shoe. I feel like that's actually pretty affordable. So I'm saving my flip flops for going in the chicken yard and stuff like that. 
and these will be more for going around and for walks. These are going to be better for my feet. The soles are actually pretty flexible. You can actually roll it up in a circle, which is something I look for in a shoe now. I've been doing more research on barefoot shoes. These I don't think are technically barefoot shoes. They're a little bit more hard to roll up in a circle like that than barefoot shoes technically should be, but I do really like that you can do that with these. These straps are really soft and they feel just really good on your feet. And these are made from recycled material, which I'm really excited about. But anyway, that is it for this little haul. I know it wasn't very many things, but I'm just so excited about all of them and I really wanted to share them with you. I will link all the things that I bought online in the description box. Obviously, I can't link the sweaters, but the shoes and the underwear, I will link all below in case you guys are interested in getting any of those. I have done a lot of research on all of those things and I feel like they're all really high quality and affordable. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!